Rival Queens, a full chronology of Prince Philip's infidelity part to a five-month bachelor party, it is widely believed that the beginning of the series of infidelities was the early death of Elizabeth's father and her ascension to the throne. It is said that the couple had planned to live much longer in the status of the heir couple, and Philip was taken aback by the fact that he would have to leave military service and devote himself to public service to become just a consort instead of the head of the family, and also to see his wife much less often. A serious transformation and an unwanted move to Buckingham Palace awaited him. He looked completely crushed, as if the whole world had collapsed on him. Recall Prince's friend Mike Parker, who was in Kenya with the royal couple when news of the unexpected death of George V.I. reached them. In the Navy, he literally commanded his own ship. In Clarence House, it was largely his show. When he got to Buckingham Palace, everything changed, added Parker. He immediately realized that the idol of his life and their joint life had come to an end. He covered his face with a newspaper and stood like that for about five minutes, recalled Pamela Mountbatten, Elizabeth's lady-in-waiting and Philip's relative. The shock of what had happened and the enormity of the consequences briefly disconnected him. From mid-October 1956 to mid-February 1957, His Highness was on a solo tour on the yacht Britannia. The trip was covered in the press as a five-month bachelor party. Philip was accompanied by his friend and comrade Mike Parker, who went through a divorce during the trip. Journalists suspected that the Duke of Edinburgh was also unfaithful to his wife and wrote that he was meeting another woman at Parker's house. Merle Oberon this may just be a rumour that arose from the echo of the star's nickname with the royal title, but British actress Merle Oberon, also known as Queenie, was repeatedly listed among the possible mistresses of Her Majesty's husband. In general, the Mumbai-born actress was called Queenie in honour of the wife of George V, Queen Mary. Incidentally, Oberon once played in Berlin, which greatly inflamed the imagination of reporters. The press also said that the star kept a photograph of Prince Philip with his personal signature, although no one ever indicated where and when Merle could have met the Duke of Edinburgh, who was ten years younger than her. Most likely, these were just more newspaper speculations. Galini Ulanova, the creators of the popular TV series The Crown in the second season, hinted that Galina Ulanova was a secret love interest of the Queen's husband. But did a forbidden romance between the British prince and the Russian ballerina really take place? Despite the lack of historical evidence of an affair between Ulanova and Prince Philip, it is curious to note that the creators of The Crown preferred to weave a real Russian ballerina, who performed in London in the mid-1950s, into the plot. Rather than create a composite female character embodying the numerous rumours about the Queen's husband's romantic escapades, the real Galina Ulanova, remembered as one of the best ballerinas of the 20th century, conquered the Western world in 1956 when she came on tour with the Bolshoi Ballet to the Royal Opera House in London, the New York Times wrote. There she delighted the audience and critics with her performances of the roles of Juliet and Giselle. However, it seemed unlikely that Galina Ulanova and Philip had the opportunity to engage in a secret affair. Given that the ballerina's time between rehearsals and performances was scheduled minute by minute, and the prince's busy schedule, they simply would not have been able to synchronize their daily routines and find time to meet each other. So most likely, Philip admired Ulanova from afar. Moreover, the 46-year-old ballerina was 16 years older than Elizabeth and had a reputation as a reclusive woman who valued her personal space. To be continued in the next part. If you enjoy our stories, please subscribe, hit the like button, and leave a comment.